greetings to all citizens of London, UK. This is an exciting time for me. Yes, we are only on the rough draft production, one third of the way through the motion picture. This is a look ahead on my very first rough draft trailer for the quadrilogy sequel, Khaleesi's Dragon Spirit Game of Thrones 2. Now, eventually, because it hasn't been put out yet, you will learn that the historical wedding takes place between William, a human, and Daenerys Stormborn of the House of Targaryen, who, in actuality, is of the world Valerian. And though he had it's slow at first in the motion picture, it's because she wants to get to know him and have all these experiences and sensual. Um, sensations that a human has to offer that no man of her world has ever been able to give her. At the same time, she gives him such sensations that no human female has been able to give him. And so it becomes a mutual forbidden love between them. And <clears throat> she, being the queen who is supposed to have the Iron Throne, this time she's going to get what she wants. And William is the key. And she does everything she can to protect him and is very successful at it because she has even told him when he was celebrated along with others who decided to make pledge of uh, allegiance and becoming her allies for a second attempt on King's Landing that he is very important to her, not just because she wants her political gains for what is rightfully hers, but has decided since she has named him a human suitor to spend the rest of the days with him since he cannot go back to his world. So the love of two dragons symbolically continues on and this time after learning laws and customs and traditions, proper etiquettes, additional mannerisms that go for her world's version of a medieval time period, uh, she had invests a lot I mean, people might not think that of that way, but yes, she invests a lot of time into him so that the prophecy of him is fulfilled up to the very end of the fourth uh, movie of Quadrilogy. So I think this is going to be quite the exciting time because at the end of uh, Khaleesi's Dragon Spirit, the battle begins, and of course that's where you're left in suspense because in the next two movies, it's all out war. Not with the dragons this time, but... A cross between the like the movie of 300, Lord of the Rings, um, <clears throat> and uh, one other one I can't think of right off right the top of my head. So it's, it's going to be quite them all out battle. And what the enemy that opposes her doesn't realize is that he's going to be using and training others to use human tactics because they're not trained for that. They've never had a human in their world before. So I think that this is going to be quite the exciting time and there's going to come a time she's going to end up coming to his aid because he's about to go through the longevity transition from eating the food, drinking her water, uh, and Alma comes a near-death experience. At the same time she's going through some type of like, as we would say on Earth, a type of mental um, the despair, because the Dragon Slayers from the Lost Pages of Time, uh, which is the mini-series that connects the last series 8 of the original Game of Thrones to the motion picture, has to keep these dragons locked up, and some people start to doubt her abilities because she lost it before, and they just don't want to be mixed up uh, in a situation where she's going to lose again, and it causes them problems. So he then has to do a special gift for her um, by allowing his blood to mix with hers, known as the blood mixing ritual. So they both get to live out home well over 200 some years of age, and probably only look to be about somewhere maybe 30 or 40. Imagine that. So it's almost like the hard way of going to have immortality, if you want to call it. So... It, it's quite the building story of the love of two dragons and so it will be coming soon and I hope everybody keeps interested. My I send greetings to Emily Clark. I so look forward to acting with her. I think that if this builds anything of anticipation, she doesn't want to miss this because Emily, I promised you when you said 
on an interview, which was on YouTube, men should be able to show themselves more like women. Well, guess what? The penis is unleashed in this movie once. It's called the uh, Pool of Passion because Daenerys wants to break William out of this modesty. He still has trouble with this. Um, but Daenerys gets very well sexually stimulated because there's just all kinds of shapes, size, penises, and making love to their wives and what have you. And this is what Daenerys wants. This is what Emilia wants. She's going to get what she wants. So, Emily, I hope I didn't turn your three shades red. My apologies if I did. But now, this is my gift to you, and I do hope we get to act this out together because this is going to be, like, so awesome. Harpies to the north, enemies to the west. One, two, that's with the Nerys, and I'll slay you. Three, four, treachery will be no more. Five, six, break your sticks. Seven, eight, victory will be great. Nine, ten, Daenerys will rule to the end. <laughs> Wait till I get a load of me. I, the human who once was a myth and a legend, am no more. Now I'm no longer talk, I am who I am. Legend of old, of the dark blue star that shines in the Valyrian night sky. I am Dragon Spear, and I defend your queen.
Okay, if you wish to make a donation to either <clears throat> website, the first one, of course, you'll have to go to dragosphere.weebly.com, click on the tab called uh, Gallery, and if you scroll down a bit, you'll see the GoFundU.com site. Uh, so it'll say, like, GoFundMe, copy and paste that into your web browser or type it in there, and you can make a donation that way. The other two are self-explanatory and are two different sites as well. We also have a special fundraiser, first time of its kind, and um, I don't claim under uh, penalty of perjury any rents, credits, royalties, privileges, or otherwise for the actual artist who made the Red Dragon. I chose the Red Dragon because it symbolically represents the Mother Dragons, Daenerys Stormborn of the House of Targaryen. <clears throat> what you don't see, and it's probably on the other side, I would imagine, is the little gray dragon, which represents me. Yes, I'm Dragon Sphere, the timid one. She takes me under her wing. And it's kind of like the motion picture now. Um, but I do claim the credit for the Tumblr idea, thanks to ABC uh, Fundraiser uh, Corporation from California, uh, who are helping me on this one. Uh, much gratitude and appreciation to all those who uh, give moral support on YouTube.com, who see that I do have a potential and have given me many um, positive comments and to those musicians who have allowed me for the Game of Thrones miniseries the Missing Link Lost Page at a Time. So much appreciation is for that. Uh, if you are interested in any of those tumblers, I will tell you right now, you're not going to find any of these in Walmart, Target, Fred Meyers, not on eBay. Sorry, this is something you've got to order through me. So you can either go to uh, Facebook, leave me a message at the uh, Emily R. Clark fan club that I did in support of her. Because she has, she has captured my heart, <laughs> so I won't deny that. And um, you can also go to, again, dragonsphere.weebly.com to leave a comment or contact me for your order for this. Uh, it'll give you basic instructions about how to make the payment, uh, but you have to pretty much decide if you're going to get it or not because you only have till uh, 30 days from June 27th of the starting of the fundraiser. So uh, this is for my goal to get to London, UK, and to enroll into the St. College of Amelia Clark went to to earn my MA degree in three years, become a certified actor, do commercials. Uh, find an agent who will help me to do my sexy photos to turn the head to women. So I think all women in London and around the world will say, hey, now it's our turn. You know, scoot over men. Let's see what this guy can do. Yes. Well, here I am. Dragon's here. The male dragon who seeks the mother dragons. <laughs> I have nothing to be ashamed of anyway. So, um, that and have another agent to promote the movie scripts to get them out there. Um, maybe even act with the original cast, which would be nice. Always I'd have to find all new cast members, and that's probably going to be a bear. But not that it couldn't be done. Um, it just wouldn't be the same with the original Mother Dragon, so, you know, how that goes. And um, also to have my London Cinema train to protect me from anyone who would get the idea, even with a copyright, to steal all my hard work, because I've been putting a lot of time and effort into this. Um, so if you would like to do support me on this, this is the Game of Thrones tumblers that I believe there's five to choose from. Uh, varies in price, depending on what you want. You can either order the one of your choice, or you can order one of each. It's up to you. But either way, here's something that I decided as a bonus. Anyone who orders a tumbler, okay, uh, not only will you be probably recognized, okay, that much I guarantee. But as so long as I have your name and your actual verified valid address, anytime a producer decides, hey, yeah, this is cool, he's willing to work for free for no pay just for the experience and expenses, this way I can't be accused of plagiarizing uh, or making a profit off the original author from the Game of Thrones. 
you know, who knows, maybe the original author might think, hey, you know, this guy's a pretty cool dude, you know, okay, we got this uh, Fire Nights, maybe, who knows, he might decide to give me a shot. I don't know. First, I get all my movie scripts out, though. Or any other movie uh, contracts, anyway. But in any, any case, um, you would get a copy with my autograph on the very first protection miniseries, Game of Thrones, The Missing Link, Lost Space in This Time, and the motion picture, a new revelation. So be sure to check it out on Facebook in my Emilia Clark fan club that I have. Uh, also at dragonsfear.weebly.com. Uh, you will see the post there with the photos and just follow the instructions that I have posted there. And I look forward to giving anyone who wishes to support me great customer service. Thank you and have a great day.